Okay. <clears throat> now, a guy whose soundtrack to his life is What's My Age Again? We'd like to call Ryan Meyer up to the stage to give his toast. <laughs> Welcome everyone and thanks for being here tonight. I know it means a lot to Eric National. For those of you that don't know me, or maybe have forgot, uh, my name is Ryan and uh, I'm Eric's older brother and best man. For those of you that do know me, no, you're not drunk. I am actually up here talking. To you. <laughs> uh, I don't really know where to start, uh, so what better place than the beginning? A little over 24 years ago, our mom and dad told me that I was going to be a little, or I was going to have a little brother. I was so excited for them to tell me that they were joking. <laughs> I never really wanted a uh, younger friend or sibling. Eric and I fought a lot as kids and never really got along. Many of you have probably seen our matching Pokemon tattoos and maybe thought it was a bit childish, but to Eric and I, they're pretty special. They mark the first time he and I started to become more like friends instead of two kids forced to live with each other. <laughs> I remember that Christmas when we got our first ever Game Boys and a copy of the first Pokemon games. We didn't even want to open the rest of our presents after we got those. We played them for hours. hours. We played those games so much, and that's really what started the bond that he and I shared. We used to spend hours and hours playing N64 or PS2 together. Eventually, I let him play my Xbox, and he ended up better, being better at most games than I am. We used to play with Lego a lot, too, building cars and racing them across our pool table. Our mom was really happy to see us playing together, even though we always made a huge mess and never cleaned it up until she got mad at us. You know how it is. You have a giant tub of Lego, so you dump it all over the place because that one piece you're looking for is probably on the bottom. <laughs> As we grew up, we started doing a lot more things together, mostly street hockey in front of our house, using the garage door as a net. Sorry, Dad. <laughs> Eric and I then signed up for the start of Medicine Hat's new youth ball hockey league, where we played together and even won a provincial championship. Eric even went on to prove how hardworking he was by being selected to play internationally for Team Canada and winning a few gold medals and MVP honors. It was somewhere during our time playing ball hockey where Eric showed just how caring and loyal he can be to the people who are important to him. Someone had thrown a, ditty, a dirty hit on me in a non-contact league and sent me to the ground. I looked up and all I saw was Eric running to fight him. <laughs> uh, Eric didn't care about getting suspended because he did and he, or he stood up for me and did what he thought he needed to do, which was looking up for somebody he clearly cares about. Eric is a hard-working, loyal, and caring person, and I'm very proud to call him my brother. I wish you and Ashlyn all the best together in your journey, and I know it will be great, and I'm very excited to see how life pans out for you, too. I really can't wait until you have kids, so no can stop pestering me about it. <laughs> That would be as 12 year old Eric would say, pretty sweet. <laughs> I'd like everybody right now to lift up their glass and toast to Eric and Ashlyn and the wonderful life that they're starting here together. Get Eric a tissue. <laughs> uh, to give the toast to the bride, uh, I'd like to call Ashlyn up to the, uh, sorry, I mean Kate. Uh, do you guys even know the difference? I know the difference. Kate, please come up with this. Good evening, everyone. 
Uh, I'm Kate. Already know that by now. Um, Ashley's sister. Good thing we're wearing different colors because now you can tell it's a party. So. <laughs> so this is a bit different for me because more often than not, I always have Ashley on my side. Um, always. It's less nerve-wracking for me having her next to me doing these things because if one of us messes up, we both go down for it. <laughs> But in this case, the pressure's on me to make a mistake, so just wait for it. <laughs> it's not just situations like this where I would have Ash by my side. It was through all of our schooling. It was when we first learned to ride our bikes. It was when we needed to blame each other for something that the other one did. It was when we lived together. It was everything. We always said that people just can't relate to us because they have no idea what it's like to have someone in this world look exactly like you. <laughs> and not only that, but always having someone there. Always. I guess that's what makes this day so unique. Is that while it's always been us, now it's someone here. Thank you for making her the ha for the happiest she's ever been. While there's so many times that she comes to me for help, I know that you'll take care of her and be that shoulder for her when she needs it. So let's stand up, raise our glasses, and let's make a toast to my literal other half, the bride who looks stunning. Could be happier for you. Cheers. 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 Now I'd like to call on some less funny panels up to the mic <laughs> to welcome the man of the night to our family. Please welcome my parents, Brent and Bob. <laughs> you wear, <laughs> your taste in sports teams, what you like, and how you act. Enjoy your stay.
Okay, lastly, um, if their speech is as organized as Eric's hockey jersey collection at home, we're going to be in good hands. <laughs> Please give it up for the parents of the room, Kathy and Les, the Captain Meyer. Welcome, Captain Meyer. Just had a peek and the New York Yankees fall 9-5 to the Boston Red Sox. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, if you do not have a toilet paper in the next bathroom. Hard to top the speeches you just heard, but we'd like to call on Ashlyn and Eric to say a few words, reflect, and uh, thank everyone. What? <laughs> Okay. I didn't think we had to come up now. I wasn't prepared. <laughs> okay. So we just want to say thank you to um, we have a few thank yous to all here. So we have Resurrection Parish. So the Parish Committee for preparing the delicious meal that we had tonight for working with Bart for us, making sure everything was smooth. Um, especially Tom, our coordinator, who has literally been a lifesaver through this whole process with the hall. So thank you, Tom. He's just walking in. Right now. Father Rick for officiating your way today, and the bartenders that we have, I don't think I just said that, I don't really know. Um, I'm going to do all of it. Okay. <laughs> um, I wanted to make sure they were wearing makeup today, I think they were the reason that we were here today, so we could thank them. I want to thank you for coming tonight, and that dad hasn't started yet, so we haven't heard the music yet, but it'll be great. <laughs> I'm so nervous, why? <laughs> um, we want to thank our Auntie Leanne, Auntie Michelle, and Uncle Rory for doing our readings today at church. We want to thank Uncle Ken for saying our prayers, and I wasn't there for this, but Julia and Lucas for handing out our programs. Thanks so much. <laughs> um, we want to thank our MCs, my brothers, Ryan and Connor, for <laughs> 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 We want to thank our, our bridal party for being the best bridal party we could have ever asked for in our special day. <laughs> our beautiful nieces for being our flower girls today, even though they would have walked down the aisle by themselves. <laughs> And last but not least, our parents, because obviously you wouldn't be here today without you. And all of our guests and family and friends, we know lots of you have to travel to be here today, so we just want to thank you for that. And that's why she's a kid. <laughs> Uh, so we have about 15 minutes, so grab a drink, go to the bathroom, take the jersey in there, do whatever you want. Dirty is most overrated shorts on Yeah, get some drinks and then the dance is going to start right away. And please, like I said before, please be responsible for drinking. Um, take a taxi and have fun. Uber, Uber's here, it's cheaper, so have fun. Thank you.